Guys, I'm LB, and we are back playing Glitch Space. Last episode, I've been losing my nerves. Hopefully this game gets at least a little bit better before I completely lose it. Alright, what do we got now? No more 50 and 90. No- no more multiply! Well, that sucks. Really, we can rotate it, but we don't get- we don't get 90. Why do you take these things away from me so randomly and arbitrarily? Like, it never seems to work. You always give me stuff that- that I shouldn't have, and then don't give me stuff that you shouldn't have. I mean... whatever. Right, so. Colliding objects greater than 3. Disable physics. Wait, what? Life force. Oops. Um, what am I supposed to do? Can I edit this one at all? I can. Can't change the apply force though, unfortunately. I always wonder what this object output is on the end of these. Huh. Why would I be able to edit this, though? I can't translate or stretch it. I can't do anything with it, really. What do they want me to do here? Colliding objects... What does disable physics do? That's what it looks like. What takes objects inputs? I done messed up now. Huh. Great physics cubes! Um... Yeah, those are big physics, physics cubes!
Those are some darn big cubes. It won't scale me up, though. Apparently they can't- can't change the player at all, which is unfortunate. Oh, those scroll bars don't even work. They just show you your position, you can't actually click on them. What do I want to do with these physics cubes, exactly? Oh, gosh. What have I done now? Right. I hate that bug where that happened. I think that used to even happen way back in the original, didn't it? What if... So disabling physics makes them just... Huh. I have no idea what I'm doing here. What the heck am I supposed to do? What is that? That's some creepy music, man. Right, well, I'm up here now. That's at least something, right? Dude, that music is creepy! <laughs> Why is this thing so huge? How can I go anywhere? Can rotate that. <laughs> Do I want to rotate this? Sure. <laughs> Let's try the Z direction. Did that even do anything? Don't think it did. What? Why is this not rotating? Can I rotate this? This game is so buggy, man! <laughs> what is going on? What? What? What is happening? Okay, I see what was happening there. Rotate object. What? Okay. <laughs> Hold on a sec. Let's just, uh, let's quit out. Cause I feel like the game's about to crash or something. Let's try this again.
I have no idea what's happening. Why is it behaving in such weird ways? Alright, let's see. Now we can rotate, excellent. Let's say... 20... That's about it. So... There. <laughs> Wait, wait. Wait, okay, there we go. Now I'm ready. Ah, come on! So close. Hey! I'll take it. <laughs> I have no idea. I really don't know what I was supposed to do there. I'll just take that as a solution. Whatever. That made no sense to me. Now we have lots of walking ahead of us. Colliding objects. Scale by... I don't know, 20? And then you, sir. No. No. Great big with cube. What the? I guess that's one way. <laughs> oh ho 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 ho! Okay, that's um. <laughs> okay then. Ooh. Uh, I think 20 was too much. How about 10? Also, why did the cubes just disappear on their own for no reason? Need to bump this up again. <laughs> Holy crap! There, get out of my way. <laughs> there. <laughs> I'll take it. Whatever. <laughs> that works. I'll take it. What is this? What is this little thing? Oh, it's adorable! Absolutely adorable. Oh dear. You made a mistake. Does it not want to multiply by 400? Evidently not. How about... Oh, right, I need to select an object, don't I? Ho ho ho! Well, let's, uh... Let's try some smaller numbers, then. At least it doesn't go in completely invisible, which is nice. But, uh... Oh, okay then. Oh dear, I left a mess behind me, didn't I? <laughs> well, let's just work on this, shall we? How 
How about... We stand on top of it. And try... Two times two. And then three times three. And then... Five times five. We're getting there. Eventually. That music is bizarre, I must say. Oh, come on, that? That kills me, huh? Alright, back to... one by one. Oh wow, I was a lot further away than I expected. Okay, next time we'll try... something smaller. Let's see here. Five times five. That worked so well last time. So how about... Nope. How about three times ten? Better. How about five times ten? Aha! Excellent. Right, well. Hmm. Man, that thing passes so close you'd almost think it was overlapping us. But it must be very giant and very far away. Either way, it's very creepy looking. Feels like we're getting closer to it, aren't we? Are we getting closer to that thing this whole game? We might be getting closer to it this whole game. Oh my gosh, we're inside of it now! Oh! <laughs> yeah, we are actually inside of the thing that we've been getting closer to this whole game. That's why the music's all creepy. Because this giant thing in the distance has engulfed us now. Oh wow, this is, uh... Quite frightening. This music is unnerving, man. Whoever did the music did a great job. Negative! Yeah! Negative! Finally! Whoa! That was weird. What happened there? Oh my gosh, everything- the whole screen's glitching out. Is it because everything's going negative? Oh wow, um... I can't move anymore. I can jump. Oh no, my cube! They took my cube! They took my cube, man! My cube that I've been using to do everything! Um... Okay, I was about to say, that white screen with the borders on it was kind of lasting a long time. But what is this? Is this somebody's home? What the? What is this thing? It looks broken, whatever it is. Are those character models? I don't think I ever saw my character model, did I? Glitch Space, the glitchiest game that I've played. <laughs> Oh, and that's the credits. Is there a fast forward? Well, the lead artist was Robin Griffiths. Another artist with Kaylee McLeod. Another artist was Moose Setener. A designer was Graham Hill. Audio was by Ronan Quigley. The lead programmer, who <laughs> did a terrible job, is Gareth Robinson. Another programmer designer who didn't really help much either was Albert Elwin. Another programmer who didn't help much either was Phil Cooper King. Pre-production designer was Carl Inglot. Special thanks to Ian Reynolds. 
Ayan, Donald, Dana, Galloway, Robin Sloan, Grigor White, Lucinda McArdle, A Birthday University, Fleet Collective, Made in Unity, FMOD Studio, Copyright, Firelight Technologies, PTY, LTD, 2012-2015, Space Budgie! Yes. Well, this is a terribly flawed game, in my opinion. It had- it had a lot of good ideas, but it never once increased the difficulty, except for that one spike near the end there. And that was just being obtuse, that wasn't really a puzzle. Oh, this is my credit screen now. What does the sandbox do? What is this, there's like a puzzle maker or something? Oh crap. <laughs> what did I just do to myself? I don't know about you, but that's definitely a different area. Do I have everything? Oh my goodness! I have everything! Oh my goodness! See, why was none of this in the game? Oh my goodness! I can just create stuff! Can I create players? <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. Oh my goodness. Like they clearly put a lot of effort into all this, but they didn't they didn't make it into the story mode at all. Five hundred. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> well, that's it for me, I guess. I guess I'm falling back down now? Who even knows what's happening right now? Oh yeah! <laughs> let's, uh, let's go with something a bit more manageable, like 100, there. Ah, much better. Good old... Good old 100. Good old portable trampoline is back. And better than ever. What is that thing? What is this thing? I'm not sure what this is, but it's all glowy. Uh... There's all sorts of interesting things to look at, aren't there? What else is there to do around here? Can we make it? Oh, it's gonna be close. We made it. Yes! Good old portable trampoline saves the day yet again. What do we do about this thing, huh? Oh crap, that's not what I wanted. And you just pass right through it. Okay. <laughs> that's- that's not as entertaining as I hoped. I'm guessing that she's go- these go to just other parts of the map, maybe? I'm not entirely sure. Well, anyway, so... As far as my thoughts on the game go... It had a lot of potential. It really did have a lot of potential, but... I think the main thing that ruined it was being able to create this object wherever you want to. Cause then that just turns it into a game of figuring out how to platform the way you can. 
And... What's making that sound? Must be something I'm standing on. And then also, the puzzles never increased in difficulty. They just slowly drip-fed new concepts. And then at the very end here, you see how many things never made it into story mode. Like, I'm wondering... Why... Why even bother with story mode if you're just gonna throw people to the sandbox to actually get the actual game that they paid for? I don't know. Doesn't make sense. I do appreciate Deathwish getting it for me, but, uh... Definitely, definitely lacking in many ways. Dude, can I see through the underside of that, or is that just hollow? No, I think it's just hollow. Well... So much for that! <laughs> well, yeah... We're just gonna fall forever now until the game crashes. <laughs> oh, man... Ah, uh, can't even see it anymore to click on it and fix it. Yep. <laughs> Let's try this. There we go. I do want to try that again, though. Maybe with a smaller number. Say, 50. Vectors... And then... It was transform stretch. Oh yeah, 50's pretty big. What about... 100? <laughs> what about... 500? Oh, I done messed up, didn't I? Yep! Yep! <laughs> yeah, I've done messed up. Whoa! Well, actually, that's the border, huh? Where am I now? Where did this put me? Where the heck am I? What? Whoa! <laughs> well, they don't call it a sandbox for nothing, I'll tell you that much. Well, <laughs> I guess I'm just gone forever now. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Alright, well... 
I don't know, I'll put more detailed descriptions of my opinion in the, in the description or comments or something. Anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!